Mooring Aleifera is a fast-growing tree native to South Asia and now found throughout the tropics. Its leaves have been used as part of traditional medicine for centuries, and the Ayurvedic system of medicine associates it with the cure or prevention of about 300 diseases. Mooring a, sometimes described as the miracle tree, drumstick tree, or horseradish tree, has small, rounded leaves that are packed with an incredible amount of nutrition, protein, calcium, beta-carotene, vitamin C, potassium. You name it, mooring has got it. Six reasons why moringa is being hailed as a superfood. 1. A rich nutritional profile. Moringa leaves are loaded with vitamins, minerals, essential amino acids, and more. 100 grams of dry moringa leaf contains 9 times the protein of yogurt, 10 times the vitamin A of carrots, 15 times the potassium of bananas, 17 times the calcium of milk. 12 times the vitamin C of oranges. 25 times the iron of spinach. <music> 2. Antioxidants galore. Moringa leaves are rich in antioxidants, including vitamin C, beta carotene, quercetin, and chlorogenic acid. The latter, chlorogenic acid, has been shown to slow cells absorption of sugar and animal studies have found it to lower blood sugar levels. As noted in the Asian Pacific Journal of Cancer Prevention. 3. Lower blood sugar levels. The many uses of the mighty moringa tree, moringa leaf moringa appears to have anti-diabetic effects likely due to beneficial plant compounds contained in the leaves, including isothiocyanates. One study found women who took 7 grams of moringa leaf powder daily for 3 months reduced their fasting blood sugar levels by 13.5%. 4. Reduce Inflammation the isothiocyanates, flavonoids, and phenolic acids in moringa leaves, pods, and seeds also have anti-inflammatory properties. According to the Epic Times, the tree's strong anti-inflammatory action is traditionally used to treat stomach ulcers. Moringa oil, sometimes called ben oil, has been shown to protect the liver from chronic inflammation. The oil is unique in that, unlike most vegetable oils, moringa resists rancidity. 5. Maintain healthy cholesterol levels. Moringa also has cholesterol lowering properties, and one animal study found its effects were comparable to those of the cholesterol lowering drug Simvastatin.11 as noted in the Journal of Ethnopharmacology. Moringa oleifera is used in Thai traditional medicine as cardiotonic. Recent studies demonstrated its hypocholesterolemic effect. 6. Protect against arsenic toxicity. The leaves and seeds of moringa may protect against some of the effects of arsenic toxicity, which is especially important in light of news that common staple foods, such as rice, may be contaminated. 5. How to use moringa If you have access to a moringa tree, you can use the fresh leaves in your meals. They have a flavor similar to a radish. Toss them like a salad, blend them into smoothies, or steam them like spinach. Another option is to use moringa powder, either in supplement form or added to smoothies, soups, and other foods for extra nutrition. Moringa powder has a distinctive green flavor, 
so you may want to start out slowly when adding it to your meals. Moringa a leaves tea, Malang A is known in Asia as a miracle plant that can help fight malnutrition. Malang A tree is abundant in most countries in Southeast Asia especially in the Philippines where it is seen in most backyards. Moringa contains 7x the vitamin C found in oranges, 4x the vitamin A of carrots, 3x the iron of spinach, 4x as much calcium as milk, 2x the protein in milk and 3x the potassium of bananas. Health Benefits from Drinking Moringa Leaves Tea Malang A tea can help increase breast milk. Malang A tea can aid weight loss. It can help restrict the growth of tumors. It can help reduce phlegm. It can help strengthen the eye muscle due to its high vitamin A content. It can relieve fatigue and stress. It can help you get a good night's sleep. It can prevent intestinal worm because of its strong detoxifying properties. It can help increase semen count. It can strengthen the immune system. It can help reduce arthritis pains. It can prevent osteoporosis. It can help make the skin healthy. It can control blood pressure. It can help relieve headaches and migraines. Moringa, the miracle plant. Step 2. Cutting Moringa leaves from the tree. Cutting the Moringa branches should be done early in the morning. The midday sun could ruin some vitamins and benefits of the leaves, so please remember not to cut them when the sun is strong. So the morning time is the best time to cut them. Always cut the freshest and the greenest looking leaves. This means cut the end of the branches, not the yellow and dried ones. Isa too has done a good job and now she returns with a nice bucket load of Moringa leaves. Step 3. Washing and peeling Moringa branches. First you need to wash the leaves with water to remove all the dust and any insects. Please repeat this two times. The leaves need to be clean. Then strip off the leaves and remove all the branches. We do this so that we can speed up the drying process, which is the next step. Step 4. Drying the Moringa leaves. You can dry them in the solar dryer. They will dry very fast this way. The air will remove all the moisture. But there is an easy way to do it at home if you don't happen to have a solar dryer. Choose a dark room with a flat surface. Clean and dark, free from dust and dirt and insects. Most importantly, make sure there is no moisture in the room. 
In the rainy season, drying the leaves would be very slow or even impossible. The drying rack in the solar dryer has a net so the air flows beneath the leaves. You can also use a woven flat surface for this, such as a bed. Finally, it needs to be dark. You can cover the windows up. Sunlight must not get to the leaves. Please don't forget to cover the leaves as well with a piece of cloth or some material. Step five, pounding. The leaves will take two days to dry out. You'll know when the leaves are dry enough when they crumble in between your fingers. You need to strain the powder to make it even finer. This is the way to obtain a fine moringa powder. Step six, measuring the moringa powder. Now we need to measure the moringa powder we have. Please do this very carefully. We don't want to drop or lose any of the moringa powder as we want to sell all of it. Moringa capsules. In order to make moringa capsules, you will need to buy this small white capsuling machine, as well as the empty capsule cases. The machine costs around 20 euros. Start filling the capsules up until they are full. Compress the powder by using the plastic tool as we are showing on the video. Then close the capsules and push them out of the tool. After you have your capsules ready, you will need to put them into clean jars. Moringa capsules are a premium product that are worth a lot of money. Those who can afford to think about improving their health and their lifestyle will want to buy these capsules. These capsules are expensive to buy, so those who buy them will pay more for this product than they would do for the Moringa powder packages, for example. 